So give us the formal introduction for All About a Check, man. You got the premiere. It's, it's... Yeah, All About a Check, uh, man, it's a, it's a very interesting movie. You know, it's about, um, it's about like five um, women and, you know, the premise of it is, Thanks for the best entertainment presets. Your feature presentation. What up, Milwaukee? Yo, what's going down? It's your boy, Sir Quinn, from Best of the Best TV, where we keep our eyes and our ears over for local, global, up and coming, and established artists. Today, we rocking with Swiss Sloan, the movie director, producer, writer, actor, innovator, man. Thanks for coming to the show, man. Appreciate you, man. Yeah, Thanks yeah. So, I, I got to ask, where did the name Swift come from? Man, you know what? A uh, homie of mine, uh, you know, rest in peace, Six Mill, man, he gave me that name. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's what the six is to yeah. be on, on the necklace. See, uh -huh. you answered two questions with one, man. Yeah. Yeah. So let's let's jump right into the filmmaking, man, because I know it's a process. Explain the process to, to making a film for those that don't know. Well, um, the first step is coming up with the concept. You Absolutely. Know, you, gotta, you gotta actually have an idea, and then once you get the idea, you gotta get either you put it into script form or get somebody else to put it in script form. You know, then once you do that, I'm I'm gonna kind of you know speed through it a little bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah absolutely. Um, so once you do that, then what you do is um, you do you head into once you figure out okay, well I got a whole script ready to go and this is the final, this is what I'm gonna shoot with. Then you, you're gonna go into pre-production, and once you get into pre-production, then that's when you're gonna choose your cast, your crew your locations, um, you're gonna come up with your budget, um, you're gonna um, you're gonna figure out um, where you wanna shoot the film at in terms of like, you know, city, I guess that would be a part of location and whatnot. So pretty much everything that's in, that entails just you making a movie. Right. And after you get done with that, then obviously it's production. You got to go into the production phase of it, which is actually shooting a film. And then once you get from production, then you got to go to post-production, which is the editing process. Yeah. Then from there, you go to, <clears throat> the, excuse me, you go from the editing process to the marketing and distribution process. So that's getting the movie out. So and, from paper to, to pre-production, generally, how long does that process take? Probably about, it depends on what kind of writers you got. Yeah. You know I mean, you know, you can, <clears throat> if you got writers that, it, where it, it, you know, it might take you all five, six months to do a script. You know, it could take you anywhere from, um, from maybe, let's say, set my fault, bro. No, it's <laughs> you know, all good. Things should have been off. <laughs> yeah, so it could, it, it could take you anywhere from maybe, you know, possibly, eight months to a year. You talking about to, to actually get it out in distribution? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, anywhere, you know, it could take you anywhere from eight months to a year. But if you got some quick writers <clears throat> and y'all able to put it together fast, you probably can chop that time down into maybe, maybe seven months, six months. Right. And that's from the conception of the idea all the way to it actually being on screen. Wow. And, and this movie making is just like 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 the housing market right now, man. It is yeah. crazy. Um, so you you at your eighth film, correct? On Tubi? Uh what is this? That's a good question. That's what I'm thinking. <laughs> I think it's seven to seven or eight, it's man. Like, yeah, I know it's at least eight that well, um, um, all about a check could be eight. Yeah. Yeah. All about a check. Yeah. That's a good watch, man. So, um, gotta ask, man, why Tubi? Why Tubi? Um, yeah. I think Tubi probably for independent artists, independent producers right now, Tubi is definitely the best option. Absolutely. Um, you know, in terms of being able to, to keep control of your of your content, absolutely. And, you know, for you to be yeah. able to have the most control, the most ownership, and also for you um, to be able to profit off the film. Yeah, that's so in that's so <laughs> um, important for independent uh, filmmakers. Um, how many um, 
Milwaukee artists or Milwaukee actors have you worked with since your development of the film? Man. <laughs> you putting us you putting us on your back, man. <laughs> no, yeah, man. Thanks, man. I mean that's that's the goal, you know what I'm saying? That's what we wanna do, man. But a lot. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I yeah. can't even I can't even really, you know, on any given any given set. Man, this is ridiculous. Okay, now I'm out of pocket. Okay, on any given set at any given time, <clears throat> I think that um you know, we probably employing at least, you know what I'm saying? Um, it's a powerful word, employing. Jeez. I, I would say at least, you know, 50 to 100 people, <sighs> cast and crew. So <clears throat> that's beautiful, a lot man. Of, a lot of our actors, they come out of Milwaukee. Some of them first time actors, you know, some some of them, you know, we we repeat with them, you know. That's beautiful. On how committed they I are. I got to shake up on that. That's beautiful, <laughs> man. See, see. Yeah. And what's the, explain your casting, uh, your casting process. Like, do you just like reach out? Like, I'm watching, I'm watching you. Like, I, I need you on the movie. Well, you know, um, what we do is, you know, um, initially what we used to do before we was able to build a database is we just like post a lot and be like, we're looking for people to be in these movies. Right. So now that, um, you know, we got a nice database of actors from Milwaukee, Chicago, Detroit, and I mean, man, really everywhere, bro. Like we, I mean, it's, we, we got Texas, Atlanta. Um, I mean, it's a lot. We, 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 we pretty much got a database of people that we, um, have encountered and some of them we've worked with before, but, um, so we use that. And in addition to that, you know, whenever we looking for other people, you know, we just post on social media, we run, um, uh, different ads on casting sites and stuff like that. Oh, beautiful, beautiful, man. In case y'all just now tapping in, we were Swift, Swift Sloan, showing your name, but we were Swift Sloan, man. We got some questions. We gonna get the formal introduction of all about a check right, right after this commercial break. For fresh yeah. haircuts, fades, and shaves with a smile, contact Donnie D Styles. Located inside Salon Solo at 6329 West Greenfield Avenue in beautiful West Dallas, Wisconsin. Book your haircut experience on the Cut app today or call 414-687-3940. Remember, for fresh haircuts, fades, and shaves with a smile. Contact Donnie D. Styles. See you soon. It's back to school season. If you or someone you know are looking for weekly or consistent hair care, I provide hair services for all hair types, lengths, and styles. Book your next appointment with me, Fine Wine Crystal. You can reach me on Instagram at Fine Wine underscore Ice or on Facebook at Fine Wine Crystal. Thank you. I look forward to working with you soon. All clients must be willing to receive hair service within a shop setting. There will be no chemical services provided at this time. Style lengths and prices vary per client, and we're now offering services for clients with tender scalp needs and special needs accommodations. Yo, thanks for tuning in. Yeah, we off a commercial break with Mr. Swift Sloan. I got his nickname, Mr. To Be Yourself. <laughs> Mr. To Be Yourself, my little nickname for him. So give us the formal introduction for All About a Check, man. You got the premiere. It's, it's... Yeah, All About a Check, uh, man, it's a, it's a very interesting movie. You know, it's about, um, it's about like five um, women. And, you know, the premise of it is, you, you know, these women, they're, you know, they're pursuing their goals and everything is just about the money. Yeah. And a lot of them, they not thinking about, you know, uh, consequences that come by mm. being all about a check. Yeah. So, you know, without giving up too much, you know what I'm saying? It's a, it's a, that's, that's pretty much the idea of the story, you know, and, um, and, you know, what, 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 what made me think of this was, and, you know, I, I, I thought a lot about how you have a lot of um, films that illustrate um, the male experience, you know, the black male experience yeah. you know, in the streets. And, you know, it shows you the highs and lows and whatnot. But it, it you don't really see a lot of films that illustrate the highs and lows of, you know, 
the consequences and the rewards or what have you of when it comes to females, mm, you know? So yeah. I wanted to, we wanted to speak to that audience. Absolutely. And, you know, it's, it's because with all my films, you know, they, they all have messages, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I mean, we, we, we illustrating what's going on in our environments, but it's always a silver lining to, you know, all of them. Yeah, absolutely. So let's, let's touch on the cast. I've seen you behind the scenes with Fancy. You got, uh, you got Crystal the dog, Crystal, Crystal the dog. Yeah. Like how you, how you build these relationships, man? I know you locked in with Jamal and all that, but like how you, how you get these, how you pulling in these, these relationships, these big well, names, man? Well, Fancy, she actually found us. You know, she, uh, Gotta shake up on yeah. that. <laughs> man, listen. Yeah, she reached out, she reached out, you know, she, um, was going into her acting career and she was venturing off in acting and she reached out you know and was you know was 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 telling me you know what she was trying to do so it was funny because the role that we had um casted her for it was it was almost like it went right in alignment with with um what I guess you would say her brand. Yeah, right yeah, now, yeah, 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 yeah. So that's big. You know, man. A, a lot of the characteristics of the character, not just solely, you know, just automatic to everything that she represents. Absolutely. So you know that that kind of played it. It, it kind of played itself out that way, and. It worked out. I'm glad we casted her for it because, I mean, man, she did a dope ass job. Wow, that's crazy. And yeah. that, that movie was shot here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. Right so, we, okay, we kind of vaguely talked about, like, the shooting process. So, typically, how long does, like, the <clears throat> shooting process take? Well, we try to knock them out in 10 days or under. <sighs> yeah. What? Yeah, we shot Untangled in, 10 in seven days. And um, yeah, we shot Untangled in seven. We shot uh, All About a Check in 10. You know, it's, it's just, I'm gonna I'm I'm tell you, bro. It's really just about you devising a system yeah. that works for you and you really working with people that's hungry. Yeah, yeah, you know yeah, yeah, and yeah, yeah. People, and people that is taking it serious. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's key, to, that's key. I was key. just talking to Steve-O on the way over here, man. We was chopping it up. Shout about, out Steve-O. Yeah, we was just chopping, yeah, make sure y'all go check out that uh, new joint that's finna come out. Yeah. Um, it's a hole in the wall. Yeah, hole in the wall, yeah, yeah. So, um, so we was just talking about, you know what I'm saying, how um, it's difficult sometimes, you know what I mean? Like when you're trying to bring certain people into the fold and they're not taking it serious. You know uh, what I'm saying? Yeah, right. So in order for you to shoot a movie in 10 days and for it to be pristine and quality and for you to be able to be proud of it, you got to have a team of people that's that's, that's for real. Hungry, about yeah. I mean, and like what kind of issues do you, not to cut you off, like what yeah. kind of issues do you run into like with people who not taking it serious, like not being on set or? Well, what you run into is you losing time. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Time is money and and in this business, time is one of the probably the most important thing that you got on your side in terms of you being able to line up everything and have a formula. Yeah, yeah, every, absolutely. Every everybody gotta be moving at a speed to where it works out for that for that amount of time that you look in the shoot. And you got a lot of people on set, man, who time you're wasting, man. Like you just not wasting the producer or the director time. You got a lot of people on time, I mean, on, uh, on set. So with that said, like, um, what, does, what does producing mean to you? Producing, well, producing means that you got to produce a product. <laughs> yeah, yeah, absolutely. You know In a nutshell. <laughs> no, I mean, it's, yeah, yeah. No, for real, it's pr producing is, it's, it's a lot of different aspects to being a producer. It's one of them is you coming up with the financing. Yeah, you know what I mean. Absolutely. To shoot a movie, that's the number one thing, right? Shh. And another aspect of producing is for you to be able to put a film together. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. You know, um, you know, my two main producers, Aaron and Helena. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to them. They do a phenomenal job at what they do, and pretty much running everything and making sure that all of the nuts and bolts is the way that they should be yeah, before we absolutely. start shooting 
you know, while we shooting, after we shoot, you know, it's it's a <clears throat> it's a round the clock situation when you working yeah. on multiple. You said projects. the system, you got that system. Yeah, so you know, producing is you you have different different types of producers. Right. You know, but the main thing is the concept is you getting it done. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And yeah. understanding that everything is, you know, it's um you gotta do shit in a timely manner. Right. Especially when you fooling with people time, as you said. Um, so circumstances, we got to touch on circumstances, <laughs> man. <laughs> that's go. So that's still from a book, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Circumstances came from uh, my three books, Motivation, one, two, and three. Right. Yeah. But you got four circumstances. What made you do four? Uh, you know what, man? Um, what made me do a four was I was just like, you know, when we did three, I felt like it wasn't over. Right. So I'm like, you know what? Let's just extend the story. I mean, at this point, it's a franchise, right? So we might as well just keep it going. And I mean, people enjoyed it, so why not give them more? Right. What kind of advice would you give a um, a filmmaker who who wants to get like a film on Tubi? Uh, well, first of all, if you if the film needs to at least meet certain aspects of quality control. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, you know, I talked about this a lot with other people, the audio being the main thing, you know? So, um, and you, you know, when, when you, <clears throat> they have a the list, certain deliverables that you have to deliver the film in. And, yeah. you know, that's, that's like you understanding film, you know what I'm talking about? Like, aspect ratios yep. and, oh, and yeah. the ways that you have the file formats and all of that. So you need to be, I would recommend it, you know, if somebody's trying to do this, that they get with somebody experienced and, um, you know, so they can mentor you into putting, putting it out and possibly putting your best, putting your best foot forward. Right. Okay, absolutely. I'm glad you touched on that. Uh, we're going to touch on his e-course for you filmmakers that want to know about any and everything. He has an e-course. We're going to touch on that right after this commercial break. Y'all stay tuned. Fine is Wine Crystal here with Best of the Best TV, where we interview entrepreneurs who've shown consistent dedication to their work. We assist others in marketing by exposing you on all successful platforms and your favorite podcast apps, as well as a special segment titled Artist of the Month, where we honor artist achievements. Contact our host, Sir Quentin Gladney, by visiting bestofthebesttv.com or email 414liftoff at gmail.com today. Yeah, yeah, thank you for tuning in. Yeah, we up right off commercial break. So this e-learning course that you have, beautiful, man. Like, um, so I'm gonna let you have the floor with that. Like, explain what's going on with the e-course. Oh, well, it's called the Swift Motion Pictures Movie Mastery Course. And, um, you know, we put it together for uh, individuals who are interested in making independent films and um, actually wanna be able to monetize these movies. So pretty much, Everything that we do is in this course, you know mm. what I'm saying? And I mean, you know, we 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 put a lot of time into this into the course and you know, uh it's it's a it's a it's a very um cool tool for film records to yeah. use, man. I mean to you know, in in a in an effort to skip the line, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Have all your answers answers, uh, all your questions answered. Yeah. Um, so yeah. Man, everything you touch in is passive, lucrative income, <laughs> mailbox money, man. That's beautiful, man. So uh, if, if somebody was interested in getting uh, or the e-course line, like how do how do they go about? Yeah, they can go to uh, our website, swiftmotionpictures.com, okay. and it's a link to the course, you know, um, but it's hosted on Thinkafix, so they can also go there and just look up Swift Motion Pictures Movie Mastery Course. Oh, that's beautiful. That's beautiful. So, um, in, man, independent film is like taking over. What's your, what's your take on like the future for independent films? Well, I mean, it's, it's, this is a very interesting time, man. You know, but I've been telling folks this for the longest, you know, before we are, uh, before we got to where we are right now, where everybody is kind of like venturing off into movies, right? Um, 
you know, what you're looking at is you're looking at a revolutionary period in film where um, a lot of the old model of what making a movie was about and how you was able to monetize the movie and actually make a profit and, and make a living off of it. All of that's changing because you have so many different, the technology is so different and you have um, a lot of different streaming services that's offering different options. You know what I right. mean? Like back in the days you had to, you had to go to, you know, you always had independent producers, right? Yeah. But you, it, there was never a period in time where um, producers and filmmakers were actually actors and everybody had this type of shot at actually monetizing their craft. Yeah, you know yeah, I mean? absolutely. And, and it's, and it's, it's, um, it's only going to get bigger. You know, um, I think that uh, what you're looking at now, I tell people this, that, you know, you're looking at the same mirror effect of, 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 of what happened in, in the rap industry. You know, back in yeah. the late 80s. Yeah, you so right. Yeah. Wow. So it, this is pretty much what's happening now is um, the film industry is, you know, it's, it's taking off just like that. Did. Yeah, it sure is. It's taking a whole different. So um, let's let's touch on this uh, on this movie premiere, man. We got it. So it, like the dates, times, everything, everybody need to know about this movie premiere. Yeah, man, all about a check. So, you know, um, it's premiering this Saturday at the Marcus North Shore Theater. Um, and doors open at 6. Movie start at 6.30, you know. Um, so, yeah, man, I mean, I'm, 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 I'm excited about this one, you know what I'm saying, you know, for different reasons, you know, because um, this was a different story, you know what I mean, that yeah. we're telling. Um, I think people are going to see a different style of... Um, producing and, and and whatnot from us on this film. You know, you know, like I said, it is it's definitely a female driven movie, you know, and um, you know, we wanted to give <clears throat> we wanted to give something, you know, to the uh, to the ladies in terms of, you know, just something for them to think about. And, you know, um it's it's a dope movie, man. I mean, you know, um so I think everybody's gonna enjoy it, you know. Um, Milwaukee always come out and support us. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. We thankful for that. So uh, yeah, man, we looking forward to you it. You answered my question. I was gonna ask you, how is your Milwaukee support, man? Yeah, Milwaukee love us, bro. Yeah. You know, I mean, you know, hey, man, listen. You know, you you uh, man, you employing you, people too. You, you, treat, you treat people good, man. You know what I'm saying? And you and and, and if you represent the right thing, you know what I'm saying? Like, how could you not get what you're supposed to get or what? you looking to get out of it. Absolutely. I mean, you taking this camera and you showing Milwaukee, you showing the world Milwaukee, man. Like that's huge, man, on a on a larger scale. All right, we're gonna have some fun with this. We got this segment called words. Personal words. <laughs> <laughs> gonna spin the wheel. Okay. Spin the wheel three times. And you let me know what you think about this word. Okay, you okay. want me to spin it? Yes, Lord. All right, you said three times? Yep. Let's see what we got. Nope. Okay. The word is family. What's your take on family? Family is commitment. Um, it's instruction. It's um, love and guidance. You know. Um, Big words with C's. She's. All right, let's get your second spin. <laughs> She's. What we got? Relationships. Relationships. Um, I would say relationships are what you make them. You know, whether it's business or personal. Relationships are important. You know, because in anything that you're doing, you need relationships to build it. Yeah. Right. And uh, you know, you know, I think relationships represent the fact that uh that it's difficult to do things by yourself. You need you need a system. I mean, you need a team. Yeah, absolutely. All right, let's get that third spin about you. All right, big one. Money. Money? Ooh. Wow. 
money, to me, money is a tool. You know, money is a tool for you to utilize to to do the stuff that needs to be done. Yeah. You know, whether it's taking care of your family, your kids, taking care of your, the people around you. And, um, you know, money is to be utilized. I look at it like money is to be utilized, not worshiped. It's, it's something that it's a, it's a end, it's a means to an end. Yeah. Wow, that's huge. I never thought of money as a tool. Like, you just made me think about the toolbox. Like, it's something that you got to have in your toolbox. That's huge, man. Yeah, think about it, bro. You can't, what, what can you do in this society that we live in without money? I mean, and when I say that, I mean, it's a lot of things you can do, but I'm talking about what can you do that actually, um, that's things that actually propel like yeah. society yeah. and move things. Not much, man. It's difficult because yeah. at some point you're going to need some type of financing Correct. to assist you in moving that forward. Correct. Whoa, that's the words game, man. He's frying my brain right there, man. We picked the brain of Swift, man. We got our word segment, man. Thanks for participating, man. So, um, what's what's next, man? Give me, give me, get, get this time, get, get this time to like shout out your team because I know you got a, a huge team, man. You got a, a system in play, man. You got some heavy hitters that you working with, man. So yeah, well, we got a, uh, we got, we just got done shooting Family Code. You know what I'm saying? And um, that's another dope movie that I think everybody gonna love. We got some special coming um, that uh, we about to shoot next. You know, I don't want to say too much about it, but uh, you know, it's, it's, um, I'm I'm happy about this one. You know what I'm saying? You know, so man, we moving. Um, I see, nigga. <laughs> you know, just gotta keep, you gotta keep rocking with whatever it is you're doing, man. You gotta believe in what you're doing, and you gotta make calculated. Oh. Yeah, facts. She's and your team, man. Like your camera crew, man. Get this, start, get this little second to shout your team out, man. Shout out to everybody. They know who they. Are. <laughs> <laughs> oh God, <laughs> yeah, man. So like, I'm I'm glad you came to the show, man. You took your time out for the show, man. You got any last minute shout outs or anything, man? Man, shout out to you for having me, man. man. Appreciate and, you. You know, shout out to Milwaukee, man. Shout out to the world, you know what I'm saying? We got we got a lot of supporters in Milwaukee, Atlanta, Detroit, uh, Houston, New York. Um, man, a lot, a lot of different places, you know. That's just so people understand that I pay attention to the analytics, you know what I mean? I pay attention to where our base is, you know what I'm saying? But, man, just I, we, we appreciate everybody that appreciates independent movies you know what i'm saying because this shit ain't easy but you know what i mean we making it happen and you know you gotta you gotta keep building and you gotta believe in what you're doing you know what i'm saying and this is really about giving people opportunities you know what i mean so that's yeah. huge man that's huge hey tell them where to find that e-course at again too man tell them where uh, to find you at too dot com. you can go to supermotionpictures.com and check out the uh course um, and it's gonna lead you to the link for the course. Uh, to follow us, you can you can hit up Swift Motion Pictures on all platforms and Swift Sloan on all platforms. And that movie premiere is <laughs> this Saturday, the 9th of September, 6 p.m. Doors open, 6:30 the movie start, and that's all about a check. You know what I mean? So. Uh, be in the building. That's huge, man. Y'all be there, man. Y'all come come out of support, man. Again, man, thanks for coming oh, to man. the show, man. For, for show, sure, man. Too, yeah, we rocking out with Swift Sloan, man. Best of the best TV.com. Go check us out. Check us out on all major platforms, wherever you uh, can find your favorite podcast. Um, and yeah, man, we rocking out with Best of the Best TV. You already know what time it is. Shh. Shut up and hustle. Yeah. You're rocking with Sir Quentin Bass. Shut up and hustle. Shut up. 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 Shut up and hustle. Shut up and hustle. Shut up and hustle. Shut up and hustle. Shut up and hustle